Goths before they can even necessarily consider uh, pushing into a tower, especially when you're pushing into sand. Oh, I have jungling that big camp, but not really gonna do too much. Fair note coming out. Air might get brought down here, but nice wisp tether and healing him up a bit. And now Chuan actually is gonna get return killed here for the probably. Right, just slap. Angelai is gonna come in. Where's he had the that toss? Rune. There is gonna be a scrap toss over on the super. Finishes off the wisp. Angelai is still alive. The brewmaster ultimate's being popped. Faith comes in here. He is going to be looking for a glimpse. It's only rank 2. He is going to get it off onto In July. In comes the kinetic field as well. Brewmaster going to try and make his escape. Looks like he's going to be alright. YYF still on the chase. Has another sprout. Looks for it on Dreamy U, but not going to happen. So, uh, ends up being a 1. Pressure on the short lane. Now, air goes in. Up. He jumps in. There's going to be a burst strike from Tron. Blink away from Ferrari. Who can they actually get here? They're looking for Tron. I don't think they have any anti invers They are burning him down with the ion shell. Fade Ball comes out, but he's still alive on 23 hit points. Luo gets lifted up into the air, but I don't think they have the burst damage to deal with him. He's just going to waveform away, and DT not really getting anything out of that... Well, not getting anything out of the Blink Dagger pickup uh, on the Brewmaster just yet. And actually, Ferrari comes in. He looks for the combo. He picks up air. Neutral kill. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Worst feeling ever. The, uh, the, the Hill Troll Berserker. That, that, that one There's going to be a Sprout over onto In July. Another combo goes out. Dark's here to fall. And like you said, Tiny with a Hastern, a very, very scary thing. The, easily one of the scariest. I mean, it's like TA with a Hastern. He jumps in mid lane. He tries to get the Primal Split off. Faith is still going to end up dropping air with this Hastern, running around. Luo joins the fight, and Avatos combo from Ferrari brings down the Brewmaster XDD. Blinks up onto the high ground, but he gets waveformed through. Can he survive this one? No Shadow Dance for the time being. Luo going to keep on right clicking away. That's a double kill for XDD. Chuan still on the hump, but he doesn't have enough mana for this burst strike. And Dreamy you actually going to end up replicating down onto the low ground. Waveform's still there. He gets the lift off, but I doubt this is an escape for the Rubik unless he can get some sick Tango Jukes going on. He just jukes into the trees, tries to the TP out. Adaptive Strike, however, going to cancel that one. And IG pick up a double kill for their Morphling. Nice. So. I was about to say, I, I was like, oh, I don't know if Luo should join this engagement. But him picking up those kills definitely makes it extremely worth it. He was a little bit too manly, I guess. Yeah, has not got the pickoffs. Ferrari, meanwhile, has finished up a four staff. So, oh, and actually, air jumps in mid lane, gonna pop off the ultimate. But Ferrari, he's got that four staff. He heads up onto the high ground, and who else can air find? There's a static storm kinetic field dropped on top of Super, who has relocated into this fight. Faith on the run from the pandas, but looks like he's still okay for the time being. And the split is just about to wear out. Super's still alive. He's gonna get sent back. There's a vacuum back onto Faith, but Tron's come in. They've brought down Dreamy U. Ferrari still in the midst of this, and he has a regen rune as well in July. Now caught in the sprout, getting right clicked down by Luo. Timely arrival from him as well. Air jumps up onto the high ground, looks for the kill on Faith, is gonna be able to get it. Meanwhile, Bar Strike goes out onto XCD. He does have a pounce, makes it down onto the low ground. He's gonna be okay for now. YYF still on the hunt, but not gonna be able to close the gap with that blink dagger, but. Uh, all said and done, I guess it's two for two, and Radiant not what DT were hoping for. It. No, they weren't hoping for it. on top lane, tier one mid. Uh, they're gonna fight this mid. Well. They have Sanking set up, and Chuan's going Chuan's again for this ult. He's gonna get it. it. Only gets the burst strike out onto one. Air caught in the kinetic field static storm, but he's just so tanky. Can Relocate. they burst him down? In comes the waveform. Oh. Relocate attempted. It's only back a tiny bit. Faith in some trouble as XD jumps in with the blink dagger. He's actually gonna get glimpsed back to safety. So ends up being a one for one, still definitely favoring IG as they got the tier one top lane. The Wisp is going to get relocated back, and he's also going to end up taking a spill. So IG picking up two, taking a tower and not giving anything in return. Meanwhile, Ferrari actually looking for a pick off on the back lines, gets the toss out onto in July, and he's actually going to be okay here. Meanwhile, XTD jumps on top of Luo, but Waveform's going to keep him safe. At least Rubik in the world, but he gets stunned up. Can they burst him down in time? He pops up his BKB, the Static Storm, not going to be doing anything. And now the Panda all comes in on the back lines. They're looking towards Faith. The uh, Disruptor Ultimate is actually being stolen, gets turned around on them. YYF to fall. And now Luo on the run does have a replicate available. He's going to keep on getting chased by the Pandas, trying to morph strength, but he gets finished off buyback from YYF, who gets sent up into the air in July in a little bit of trouble but able to run away from the tower, still surging around the edges. Tuan is going to get that kill with the Burst Strike, but YYF focused, brought down, triple kill for XCD on this Slark, and uh -oh. DT, nice team fight for them. Tuan also still on the run, has a Burst Strike, has a Blink. He's going to be okay. I feel like IG is doing, playing this, just like I was saying before, pretty sloppy. Their lineup isn't really the best team fighters. Disruptor, sure, he's basically the king of team fighters. For our fights, some of the times he teleported in was just fine, but I feel like he should have been just splitting them up a lot more. Oh, and XCD, he jumps in, just immediately stuns up Ferrari. He's going to be bursted down, and so will Luo. What were they doing there? XTD 
now beyond God, like the Brewmaster Ultimate's been used, he's just hunting inside the base. Yeah, no reason stack. not to. Do There's we have no buybacks place. available? There's a buyback. Yeah, buyback available for the Tiny, he's going to be forced to use that one, but there's no buyback for the Morphling XCD. Deep inside the base, is going to get glimpsed a little bit further back. They look for the combo, but he gets the Shadow Dance off. They're chain stunning him for now with the Avalanche, but XCD, he's found the opening. There is going to be a nice Force Staff getting him back to safety, along with the Pounds. BKB popped off from in July. Ferrari oh, gets lifted. He can't afford to die back here. He is going to use his Yules to keep himself safe, but Air comes in. He's got the BKB, no mana available. Tron just waiting for this Burrow Strike. Keeping an eye on that timing is going to come through for the burrow. Air in some trouble, Static Storm, but Super comes in. He gets the relocate out. He's going to be okay. And XCD just going ham. Brings down why we have actually Dreamy You coming in there as well with the waveform. And XCD is just absolutely huge. They bring back Air. He's looking pretty healthy. Morphling's still dead for 15 seconds. 55 seconds on YYF, who does have a buyback available, but. Damage down onto the tier 3s. Can they find anything here? XCD just jumps on top of Ferrari. He yules himself for now. And the BKB has been used. Dreamy U gets the lift off. Air comes in. He's looking for the crit. They've managed to bring down the tiny. Who else can they find? DT retreating a little bit further back. Air still on the chase, but has, has to give up the kill on Faith. In comes the Morphling. He's finally respawned. Gets the shotgun out onto the Brewmaster. Super able to recover that gem. Trying to escape. One last slap. Not going to finish him off. XCD. Keeps on going, YYF did buy back into this fight, but XCD just cannot be stopped, he keeps on going. I think his team is calling for a retreat at this point, and he is going to get glimpsed back. Jumps onto Faith immediately, Lincoln Sphere pops off, Kinetic Field not there, a little bit of body blocking from Tron. There is a burst Strike, and they do manage to finally end that Beyond Godlike streak. Fortunately, also going over onto Tron, leading the way with the gem, looking for a pick off air. Is going to be able to blink away as that smoke gets revealed, but Dreamy you he's actually got a BKB on this Rubik, blocks the combo, XCD going to jump right on top of Tron, that's going to be no epicenter, no He gets the Static damage. Storm again too, but it's not the biggest deal, slowing down XI, Luo, but wow. Oh, YYF, he gets bashed, he tried for the TP out, but XCD is just way too big, double kill comes out. Luo's all alone. Luo's on the run. Can they bring him down? He's got a double damage, but he's just not able to fight, his replicate is a little bit further away, so... Looks like he's feeling fairly safe and yeah, just gonna be able to jump over towards mid. But that was a disaster for IG. They were that the ones Rubik on the front BKB. Foot. Not yeah. expected. No, at nobody all. expects the Rubik <laughs> BKB. Gotta just do a lot of damage. He doesn't have to oh, watch. Barstar comes in. Air. Can he get the ultimate off? Ferrari doesn't get anything down. There is a nice kinetic field static storm. But Luo, he pops the Aegis immediately. Can his team get in here to help him out? Faith in some trouble. Stunned up. Luo meanwhile returns to the fight. Hay is going out over on the Tron, not able to get anything done here. Luo just trying to slap the Air Panda, but that's all he's got done in this team fight. And the melee barracks is already falling. They've got the well, they've got the wall of replica up in just a few seconds. Luo gonna see what he can do, but just sends the illusion forward, realizing that this Rax is pretty much a ready forfeit. But Rubik, IG, still, what can they do? And Rubik still has that Static Storm. He didn't get, he didn't use it that last team fight, so it's gonna. They're probably gonna be able to keep going here, and they're trying. Is just ridiculous with these those items and the overcharge. He's just yeah, and he jumps in. Golden. What's he gonna go for here? He does get stunned up, but Air is right there along with him with the BKB in July. Trying to open up Luo. Will he be brought down? He's trying to morph strength, but he's gotten stunned up. Right clicks are gonna be enough to bring him down. His own illusion. That's the game. More useful than he was in this fight, and he doesn't have buyback. That's probably just it. XCD moves forward onto the racks. Faith on the run. He's gonna get stunned up, but DT they they smell the victory. They're just gonna XCD's. go straight in and. Chuan calls the GG, he's had enough. DT gonna take this win, and well, that puts IG, I believe, at 1-1. One one. DT also 1-1, one one, so this ranking stage getting pretty interesting. Wow. I just... IG just team fighting way too much early on. Like, the Pandaldi's being up, and they're constantly committing four